we came to the supermarket to buy some food so we can cook for the week. And look at this, this beer is, this is local beer from Brazil. And it's like the by Playboy, which has nothing to do with beer, but okay. We are on our way to uh, the university, Flavius University. And hopefully I get to see what she does to the rats, to the poor rats. Today is Friday, so maybe not, probably not. They might be going out, but I don't think I'll go out. We'll see. We have three weeks that I might be here, so... Starting, I think, Monday is three weeks. So we'll see what else I can do around here. But anyways, this university is one of the biggest ones. It's the biggest one in Goiás. Goiás, whatever. The state. It's the biggest university in the state. It's the federal university. Guys, I'm chilling here at Flavius Job here at the university. And they have a bunch of these little rackets. If you guys don't know what these are, these are rackets that kill mosquitoes. They're electrified, so you sweat them and they shock them. And hopefully you kill them because I hit some and they shock them and they're still alive. But they have a lot of them because apparently there's a, there's a lot of dengue around here. During the dengue season. And I think it's because the lake is right next to here. So it's the university and the lake. So I think that's why there's a lot of mosquitoes here. But uh, I'm not allowed to film, otherwise I will show you guys the rats and what she does with the rats. It's like a psychology, biology experiments. This is the university, part of the university, like I said, like she said, well, like we know, it's very big. So this is just one of the buildings. Miyoko. Huh? Miyoko. Okay, that's the name of the building? How long is the building? 600 meters. Pretty long. So guys, this whole building is just for the cafeteria of the university, which is crazy. I'll show you guys why. So guys, check it out. Here's a breakdown. This right here, which is just rice and beans, and then maybe like a salad. Regular price for me that I'm not a student is 10 reals, but for her it's 2 reals because she's a student. But it's two reals, but the university has to pay 16. So she pays two and the university pays 16. So that's 20, no, 18. That is 18 reals for rice and beans. It's crazy expensive. We are going to a park, kind of a park, you can call it. We'll see what it is. Oh, yeah. that bull I heard about this bullshit, isn't it? Yeah, I don't know why. No, keep going. <laughs> what was the prophecy about? About Brazil. Mm -hmm. That they would build a city like this. But I don't know what's so magical about it that people keep telling me. So yes, this is the guy who made a prophecy saying that they will build a great city in, in the plains or something like that. Yes. Alright, so he was Italian and it says that... And he had a dream mm -hmm. there, in a place between the, I don't know, where the things that divide the earth is and the east. Oh, okay, in that latitude, in, yeah, that, yeah. in those coordinates. Would be a lake. In between those coordinates, there will be a lake. Yeah. And there would be a great sea, a civilization. Yeah. And he, like that. he said that in 1883 in Italy. So then this city is in between the 15th and 20th parallel and it's by a lake and it's a great city. So yeah, this is this is a great view of a fake lake. And the fake lake. The lake is real. And what is man made, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> and the rich houses. All of this section right here on this side of the lake, it's a bunch of like very expensive housing. Because on the other side of the lake you can't you can't build houses. It's all government buildings and the university. Guys, check it out. This right here, you will never guess what it is. First of all, see how big it is. It's like bigger than my hand. Or her head. <laughs> this is an avocado. I've never seen an avocado like this. And I was telling them that they were black. They never knew they were black. They always eat them like this. And they're green. And the catch. So as you guys can see, <laughs> he's gonna be making a. Rafael's gonna be making a avocado shake, yeah. and he's making a mess. 
Yeah, I always make a mess in the kitchen. It's a little, he's strong, now she's falling down. She has here. There's no friends in war. Yeah, no friends in war. Uh, just a little cool. And then we will go. <laughs>